With Thanksgiving right around the corner, I wanted to show you some of my favorite healthy recipes that we always have at our Thanksgiving dinner. You know, I know it's more of an indulgent holiday, but sometimes it's nice to have healthier options just because you won't leave you feeling so heavy and almost like you're gonna go into a food coma after the big meal. Now, first I wanna show you is my homemade gravy recipe. You know, a lot of the traditional gravies are made with turkey fat, which is very high in saturated fat. So if you do have high cholesterol, that's really probably something you shouldn't be eating. Now this one that I made here, it's just made with vegetable broth and then I use spelt flour. And of course I added in some herbs and spices that are great for your health to just bring out that delicious gravy flavor. And it is so thick and creamy. You know, I love adding it to things like mashed potatoes or the second dish that I have here to show you, which is a healthified version of chicken and dressing. Now, depending on where you're from, you may not have heard of chicken and dressing before. It's definitely popular in the South. This is actually one of my grandmother's recipe that I made healthier by making it a vegetarian um, alternative. So it still has all that great flavor and it's actually still very high in protein, but I love to slice this up. This is actually usually what we use as our main dish and I pour the gravy on top it is so good like I look forward to eating it every year and then I have a mac and cheese dish which I grew up on this it is a staple that we always have at Thanksgiving but this one is made healthier by making it with a cashew cheese sauce so it is completely dairy free the cashew cheese sauce is so easy to do you just throw the ingredients in your blender blend it up and then you're even able to choose your own pasta option so you could use like a gluten-free pasta a lentil or bean pasta just again to give you some healthier options, but you still have all the classic flavors right here. Now to get these recipes, you can go to abc10.com slash Meg, and I hope to see some of them at your Thanksgiving dinner this year.